Alright, I've cleaned up a little bit and uh, took the camera off of its tripod, so this is my set, my uh, recording setup, by the way, just to have my tripod here and my bag of camera things. Uh, but, so, you see this, uh, this figurine, you might think, well, this is the first video about a figurine that I've done on uh, on this channel. So this must be the first figurine that I've bought. Well, you would actually be wrong if you assume that. You see, uh, I actually have I have a little shelf over here. I've got a few things over on the shelf. So this is actually the uh, the third. I'm going to oh shit, just tripped over the box. This is the uh, be careful. The third of uh, of three figures that I have bought so far, and put the, oh, right here you can't see that. So, uh, give you a little tour of my uh, my little area here. So, I've got a uh, as you can see, I've kind of got a got a got a theme here: Kimikaze and Amatsukaze, both prize figures. This one's a Sega one. Uh, I bought it pre-owned, but it was a uh, pretty cheap, like twenty-six dollars or so for that one. I think like thirty for this. Um, they're about the same size. I don't know if how how well that translates over the over the camera, but actually I'll put them put them, put them next to each other. There you go. The base that one's a little smaller, but pretty much the same size. So. And then uh, I've got this uh, this uh, Sop 2. This is a Hobby Max. What's a Hobby Max Mini Craft series? Uh, like a like a Nendoroid, but different, small, and uh, comes with some interchangeable face plates and stuff. This was uh, I think 85, 90 ish dollars. I got this got this new. Uh, it's a uh, limited. I, I I should have done um, a video about about like about this, but I didn't really think about it at the time since this channel is mainly about technology, and I figured that oh, I just didn't think of it at the time. But but here we go. It's all going to be one video, I guess. And uh, so I've also got this um, this Tomy Tech little armory. 112th scale little uh, gun here, and it's in a, I have it in a bag so the little pieces don't blow off everywhere. But got this, and uh, that was I, I think like $25 as well, so pretty cheap. And then over here, I've got my uh, my very very small Vocaloid, a very uh, one one dimensional just the uh EA project promotional CDs zero one not the this is the standard edition not the fancy one with the black case so I don't have any of uh, the DVD but this one uh zero four um, try taking it out of the case hopefully I don't break something this comes with the uh the CD and the DVD, so got the uh, the special edition here. And it was actually this is actually in a uh, again I would have done a video about looking at this too, but it didn't cross my mind at the time. But this was actually sealed, and if I wanted to, uh, you know, turn a profit or something, I probably could have kept it sealed. But I don't, I don't. I'm not. I'm not a collector. I buy things to use them, and. Uh, I've also got this up here. These are little postcards that came with the uh, came with that zero four DVD case thing. They all they all have Japanese postcard like information stuff on them. I'll try to take one of them out without ripping it. Oh yeah. Hold on. Yeah, I don't I don't know if that would be how I would even use this since I'm in the states, but. Pretty cool, pretty high quality printing on these two. And then there's, it also came with this advertisement for the, uh, some kind of, yeah, the world premiere f 
world tour final and premiere of ARIA thing. So basically just to have an advertisement on my little board here, but it's pretty cool because it has the has the art. And then this, uh, since I bought it from AmiAmi, I got a little AmiAmi thing, which is pretty cool. I didn't know that they, uh, they shipped these, but it's pretty, pretty cool, so. Yeah, this is, uh, this is my, my tour of my little, uh, my little weeb corner that I have going on here. Hold on, it's not in focus. There we go. So, um, I'll, I'll, uh, just, I just kind of started getting into this stuff. Like, I, th I think that, that was the first thing I bought, and that was, like, a few months ago. But I've kind of started getting into this, so I'll, I'll do more updates when I, uh, when I get more stuff, and uh, I guess like comment if you uh, if you find this interesting or if you want to see more or if you want to know anything in particular, you can ask and I'll uh, I'll answer your questions, I guess. But yeah, so hope you hope you enjoyed. Bye. See you next time. Oh, also one more little thing. Um, there's this website called My Figure Collection, which um you use to like catalog your all your weeb stuff that you buy and it, it seems seems to be a pretty good website from what I uh, what I've seen I just joined it uh, a little bit ago but they have a uh, this little is a rule where the thing the things that you catalog they have to be uh, both a Japanese like IP like character and then also made or also made by a uh, by a Japanese um, company which you'd think would be all right, but but uh, this I can't put on there. There's no there's no uh, listing for this. Same with well no, there is actually one for this. As you can see, that's the third one there. Since uh, since Tomi Tech is Japanese, <clears throat> but there's also not. I can't put this on there. These two can even though these were these two combined cost less than this. Actually, those two and this combined cost less than than this alone. But I can't put this on the on the website, and then I also can't put this side of the thing which I didn't show you. But I have a little uh, little Junior uh, plushy keychain thing, and then also this which I bought from some automotive blog website. But a little bit, little bit of uh, that's not that's not really weed things, just kind of a, a car thing. But so that's just a, a little a little uh, unfortunate. Right, of course it doesn't really matter that much, but it's a little uh, unfortunate that I can't you know, share my entire collection on, on this website, and I, I don't know, there might be alternatives, websites with different rules, but I haven't really searched that far, but it's a little kind of annoying thing, so, yeah, bye.